this is coffee Tuesday or is it Wednesday I don't know what day it is it's coffee day Joey's extra excited he's been so sweet he's been telling me he loves me so much all, all morning because I'm, I told him we're gonna get him a cookie monster I'm gonna go to Walmart and buy him a cookie monster and Gabriel's also getting a toy yeah Gabe snake my sweet little boys are gone and I'm trying to make some soup here um, halfway done basically I got potatoes in blood pepper onions carrots so right now I'm trying to shred these um, homemade fermented pickles and I think I'll be done and then um, obviously mm, yummy um, I'll be adding the quinoa brown rice so and that's it and my soup is done and then Danny was asking for coconut macaroons again he loves those things um, so I'm thinking I might be able to do that too because since I'm almost done with soup why not um, they just left the house about 15 minutes ago so yeah there's the he beloved cookie monster he wanted he can't the last one here cookie macaroon you want to take it home? Yeah! Okay. I really like it. That's nice. Yeah, that is really cool. It looks like a spider. From Sue? Wow! Can I play with that? Oh my gosh! Papa, look! Papa, snake! Papa, look at this! Papa, look, 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 look! This is your stuff for this gun! Mm -hmm. And even have sunglasses. Yeah, you got and glasses even, and a even, hat. And they have a clock and... Even more stuff, and he will be Wow, this is what Yeah. What vacuuming? For vacuuming? What rescue? Oh, for rescuing, yeah. Yeah, the two Yeah, Buzz like, Lightyear is gonna rescue somebody, yeah? Like, it can fly. Mm -hmm. Say, look! Buzz Lightyear! Joey, what are you doing? Like you don't like turkey Only thugs? that one. You like the pink huh? one? Can you switch yeah. hats? Wow. I don't even have a clue what to tell you guys. What can I share with you, huh? What would you like to know? Oh, Candace. I have no idea what the baby boy's name is. For real? I have no clue. Um... We had like one name chosen. I don't even want to say because I a lot of people are like, eh. So I don't even want to talk about it because it wasn't even serious to begin with. So then we th were thinking of another name. And my heart's just not necessarily set on it. And um, my um, initial reaction for a lot well I should probably say all the names because if it was just a lot of names then I'd probably have a name chosen um but my reaction is no like like I hear a name and I'm like uh-uh no nope nope <laughs> so I don't have a name I'm horrified and here I am like rushing this baby out and he doesn't even have a name we still call him hi baby <laughs> so yeah no name Oh my gosh, yes, I'll be 40 weeks in like, what, five days or something like that? It's crazy. It is unbelievable. How did I even make it? No clue. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm still home alone. I like this time. I really, really do. And before I got pregnant, when Danny would take the boys out, like, to do an errand, he would take the boys with him. Um, I always, like, ran around the house and cleaned up everything. Toys, laundry. But right now, I can't really do that. But you know what? Look at this. It's still clean. Totally magical, huh? Totally clean. I like that. I was telling Gabriel how proud I am, I am of him for helping mama like that. And he, it's like honey to his, um, I don't know how you say that, but basically he loves compliments. And of course that motivates him to do it again, which is lovely. And I just hope that they get into that habit where they just, you know, clean up every night. Um, 
instead of like leaving the mess. They did leave these trucks over here. They parked them under the dining table. <laughs> So I was like, Gabby, we need to clean that up. And he's like, no, but he's like, Joby, we'll wake up in the morning and we'll play with them. I'm like, okay, fine. I'm like, it's not in my way. If the midwives have to come in in the middle of the night and we have to like get the tub, you know, all blown up and, and get, you know, filled, at least those cars are not in the way of all that. So yeah, I'm trying to mix this with a spoon. I think it needs my hands now. Yeah, I wonder what these macaroons would be like if I drizzled some melted uh, melted um, chocolate on top of them. I think they would be fabulous, but I could even try a little bit, but I don't think I want to do that. Just curiosity. I wonder what they would be like. Um, my soup is done. I had some. It's delicious. I think I oversalted it a little. So unfortunate. I tried to scoop out some of the liquid here in a bowl and then... Um, Adding some boiled water from a teapot. Um, yeah. But here's the soup. It's the same soup that I made a week ago. Funny. Yep. Same exact soup. This Russian soup that um, is like chicken or beef. And it calls for potatoes. It calls for barley. But I don't have barley and I don't like barley. So I like I said on the video. Blah, blah, blah. I already mentioned this before. So easy and pickles like shredded pickles um, That's like what makes the soup different is the pickles. It just gives it like a little sourness and um, Yeah, kind of like changes a regular chicken soup into like a, a different kind of soup If that makes any sense at all So yeah Soup is done. That's wonderful because now we'll have lunch for three days. I'm so excited <laughs> Uh, it would be funny and awesome if I could just get this done, you know, make this like I did the soup and make the macaroons and and then just go into labor. And then tomorrow, oh, give me that soup that I just made yesterday when I was pregnant. So <laughs> I think that's kind of nice. Instead of going into labor when the house is fridge is empty, that would be not cool. Okay. Danny got some paper here for something he is about to do. Some, not activities, but something else. Oh, I'm just gonna rest a little before I go back in the kitchen and, and mix all those macaroons and, and shape them and, um, yeah. Um, you know what my, my midwife was saying in the last appointment? She was asking me kind of like, how do I feel like mentally, emotionally? Like like at the end of pregnancy and she asked me like like when you do feel irritated um or sad do you want company or do you want to be alone so i said oh definitely company i'm like i want to be with danny but not the kids i just want danny or you be able to talk to somebody on the phone and she said to take homey um uh pulsatilla homeopathy and she said to take it once a day and she's like, some days you need two times or more, and some days you won't need it all. And it's absolutely natural. It it works. I mean, I read how homeopathy is made, and I still don't understand. <laughs> it's like this weird, like, it doesn't even have the, it's like it has the essence of a particular flower or um, a herb or something so for that pulsatilla is great for kids when they are like having colds or when their personality matches like when they are clingy and sweet and a little bit manipulative and just as they snuggle um, especially when they're sick they snuggle even more so kind of like that and that's how I felt I felt like a pulsatilla so but I haven't even needed it because I've been pretty, I guess, happy and stable these days. Like, I can talk to kids, I can look at them, and I can enjoy their presence. Um, that hasn't happened to me in, like, quite some time in this pregnancy. I think it probably due to that stress of having a premature birth. I feel like a fool now. Totally. I totally feel like a fool for thinking I'm going to go into preterm labor. And here I am, almost at my due date. Wow. 
um yeah so but that's that's good to know and i just wanted to share that with um any of the pregnant ladies out there if you guys um if you ladies feel you know like like weepy and emotional and you need somebody to listen to you pulsatilla yeah it's like a pulsatilla is a flower that um whatever the wind blows it you know it, it leans where the wind blows so cool yeah somebody needs socks you need, you need that. That's so awesome. I did it your time. Yeah, you did. Good job. Why are you fighting, Joey? He's saying we don't have a cookie monster. Joey's saying you don't have a cookie monster. We just bought you one. Joey, we do have a cookie monster. No. Why is he saying that? He wants. Don't have cookie monster. You don't have it here, but you have it in the car. Do you want me to buy you another one? Is that why you're saying that? Yeah. Why is he saying that, Gabe? I don't know. He doesn't have it. He's not happy. No, we. Oh. And there they are. Yummy, delicious coconut macaroon. Let's get those babies out. Wow. Okay. Um, cookies are done. That's lovely. Now, I don't know if I should do this now or not. I'm kind of busy working on the computer. But, and I'm in this crazy cooking mode. <laughs> Let's see. I want to make those latkes. The sweet potato latkes, believe it or not. I like them so much. Um, that I actually want to make more. And it was a lovely breakfast. You just reheat them in a little toaster oven with some sour cream. Yum. I actually do wonder how much protein it has. Probably not much because it's a vegetable, so... That's one thing that's missing from that meal. If it was had protein, that would have been lovely. That would have been awesome. But yes, I have been craving sweet potatoes. And did you know that... Hormones need sweet potatoes. It actually feeds them and supports them because I guess of all the nutrients that it has. It's great. Um, oh, I'm out of breath. <laughs> so, yes, I might just do that. Very tempting. Here is um, a printout of that recipe. And... Um, I really want to make some. Let's see. I gotta wash dishes. Who wants to wash my dishes? Hmm? Everybody? Yay! <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, I gotta clean up before I can do those latkes because I actually need a cutting board. I need this big bowl from the coconut macaroon. So I can't even make that stuff right now. So I'm gonna wash the dishes and see how much energy is left over. Probably not much. I think he's got a purpose. I think he's got a purpose, maybe. Let's put, you put the cookie in here. Is it gonna burp? <laughs> cookie monster, where's you like the cookie? It? It's not me. You like it, Joey? Uh, huh? Oh, Joey, there you sweetie, are. do you like it? Yeah. You can do it. Yes, I can. Do it, do it. Dum, 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 dum. Ooh, my goodness. <laughs> this is going to get a little bit messy. Bill, look. <laughs> like that. Just like that. You squeeze it. You mix it all up together real well. And then you put them on oil and you cook them up. Oh, yeah. Hmm. See? <laughs> Looking in the camera, huh? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Hello. Hello. Uh-oh. You, <laughs> you guys are funny. Yes, yes, Joey. Yes. I want to do. You want to see? See that? I'm going to see that. I think I might need two hands for that. Hmm. 
tonight we are cooking these latkes on coconut oil. I love coconut oil. But um, since Danny is not eating them, um, I'm gonna make this just for me. And I, I wanna make them on coconut oil instead of bacon fat. So healthier. Yay! So this is what it kind of looks like when it's all mixed. And um, I have some oil heating here. <laughs> um, I think I have completely went nuts today here in the kitchen cooking. Like I said, I did the soup, the coconut macaroons, and now I'm almost done with the lot. Let's look at them beauties. There's four more in there, but those are the last ones. What else am I cooking next? <laughs> Just kidding. I'm done. I am so done. Like, I would cook more if my feet and my back would be okay. But my feet are really sore right now. And my back is getting pretty sore standing in one spot, you know, like washing dishes or something. And I'm standing over those things. Oh, goodness. And I have the um, two little... How can I show you? See? Two naked little people. Mm -hmm. They just took a bath and they just came out. So I gotta go find our pajama. So they can be ready and I can't leave until I get these little things out. Yeah, tomorrow if I'm not in labor, I'm gonna make my husband some regular potato. Like red potato latkes. So he can have that maybe with breakfast. I'm sure he's gonna like those. Just not sweet potato, not his thing. So yeah. If I'm not in labor tomorrow, I will be making those. So yeah, beep, beep. one minute. And then I get three out and flip one. Good night everybody. Busy day is over and we are heading to bed. My boys are, are tired and whiny and it's definitely bedtime. So I'm gonna go grab those little munchkins and head to bed. So you guys have a great night too.